go ahead. Okay. Hi, I'm uh, Mark. I'm a math student from Denmark at the University of Southern Denmark. And um, this is Kia. Hello, I'm Kia, and I study uh, molecular biomedicine. And uh, our project uh, was the back toe bandage. Um, the, part, the purpose of the project is to create a bandage with a, with a engineered E. coli species to produce a, a short peptide called RIP, which inhibits the formation of biofilm by Staphylococcus aureus. Well, to, to put it simply, it, it stops bad hospital infections from developing into really, really bad ones. I noticed that uh, you, you, you talked about um, antibiotic resistance on your poster. Could you tell us more about that? Yes, of course. Um, antibiotic resistance uh, is the term for uh, uh, pa pa when pathogenic bacteria develop resistance to conventional antibiotics, they, they become harder to treat because the antibiotics is pretty much the only weapon we have against them. Um, but with this uh, and in other emerging new treatment possibilities using chrome quenching, um, we are able to reset the timer for, for resistance. So when using a combination therapy with RIP and a conventional antibiotic, uh, it, it works pretty much the same way as before the, the bacteria got resistant. So we're very excited about that. Great, very good. Um, how did people react, like your friends and family, when you talked to them about synthetic biology and the work that you did? Um, I think my family pretty much stopped listening about five years ago. <laughs> so you've been doing things like this for that long? No, no, no. Okay. Just uh, high school stuff as well. <laughs> yeah. It's just too, too complicated. There are too many details. They don't really understand what's going on. So it's right. Just, oh, so you're in the health category. Fine. That's great. <laughs> yeah. Um, can you think of any possible uh, um, negative side effects that might come from either your work specifically or synthetic biology in general? There's the concerns about biosecurity um, and things like that. Uh, anything related to your project that might be of concern? Well, there are a lot of, there are a lot of genomes being manipulated and you introduce genes from other organisms and you have to make sure that you can control these organisms, that they don't get loose, so to speak, uh, either in nature or on the body, human body or something like that. So you need to put in some safety restrictions so that they might not survive. Or, it's a little bit like Jurassic Park, actually. <laughs> so, uh, so if they get loose somewhere, they won't survive. Right. And how do you feel you did this weekend? Sorry? How do you feel you did this weekend? Did well, yeah. Very good. Is first, this your first year? Yeah, first time we participated. Great. First year in Denmark to participate yeah. actually. Very cool. Well, congratulations and thanks a lot. Thanks. You're welcome.